Hey guys, happy Sunday after Christmas. So, last week was Christmas week, and that's great. I hope that each of you had an awesome time with your family, with your friends, just enjoying one another, your presence, reading the story of Christ, really just, just diving deep in there and celebrating the birth of Christ. And I know that food was present. It was present at my house, um, and we had lots of it. It was yummy. And I honestly took Christmas Eve and Christmas Day and just ate whatever I wanted to because I've been working hard. Um, it was delicious. Obviously, I mean, I didn't try. I tried not to just go crazy, but I did eat what I wanted to, and um, it was good. It was it was, it was was yummy, uh, but I'm feeling it. I kind of feel bad. I feel sluggish. I feel bloated. I feel like I have three pounds of water weight just from the salt that I ate. I know I do. Um, I can see it, and I can feel it. My scale reflects it. Um, <clears throat> so now, I feel like I want to get on track. I love being back on track. Um, yes, I love to indulge. I love some yummy food, but my body thanks me when I treat it the way that it is supposed to be treated. So today, I am sitting down right now. I am creating my meal plan for the week. I am ready. Um, I have food in the house. I'm going to create, instead of going to the store or trying crazy recipes this week, I'm just going to eat what I have and create my meal plan based on that. So if you haven't been to the store yet, um, create your meal plan first. Keep it simple, guys. Don't think about trying brand new recipes or complicated recipes. Just stick with things that you know. You know, maybe you just have grilled chicken and a sweet potato and steamed broccoli, you know, a couple nights a week. Maybe you make a crock pot of chili uh, before you leave uh, for work or if you're home on Tuesday morning and you eat that for dinner that night and then you eat it again for lunch the next day. Keep it simple. Don't overwhelm yourself. Uh, but definitely make a meal plan today. Make sure that you have healthy snacks on hand. I am going into my pantry, into my kitchen, and I am getting rid of the Oreo balls and of the chocolate bonbons and of anything that will get me and Matt off track this week, okay? Um, that's important for us. If it's here, we eat it, especially when I'm home like this. Um, temptation definitely gets the best of me. I graze, I snack, and that's not good for me. Um, so that's the, creating my meal plan, prepping my food, getting rid of all the junk. Those are the first things that I'm going to do, okay? Um, and so this week, I really want you guys, don't beat yourself up. If you just went way overboard over Christmas, if you've gotten completely and totally off track, you've checked out of this group, don't let that be the end, okay? Just get back on board. Create your meal plan. Share it in the group for accountability. Print it off. Staple it to your wall. Put a magnet on the refrigerator so that you see it. You know, whatever you need to do to help you stay motivated, just do it and know that we are here. If you need prayer specifically for something, um, maybe you have a hard time getting the junk, just throwing it away. Um, maybe you have family members who don't support what you're doing. Um, Maybe you just really, really love sugar and just saying no to it or Diet Coke or a Coca-Cola or whatever it is. If you need prayer, that's what this group is for. We are here to support you, uh, to encourage you, and to give you ideas. So this week, let's make it happen today. It starts with planning and prep. I cannot stress that enough. I'm going to share my meal plan here whenever I'm done. And I want you guys to do the same. Those of you that committed yesterday when I asked you if you were ready to get back on track, let's do it today. Um, do you have your workouts ready? Put your workouts on your meal plan. You have to schedule those just like you would anything else to make those happen, to make them a priority. But I am rooting for you guys. I am totally praying for you guys. And I know that this week is going to be way better than the last week. So let's do this. Let's get started. And I will talk to you soon, okay?